So I recently had an indicator bulb go on the Classic and the reason I knew it had gone was because when I went to turn right, I'd hear the click of the indicator, but the indicator dash light didn't illuminate. Whereas if I went left, it would. And that told me that one, either the front or the rear, it's not hard to find out which, was out. So let's have a look at changing that. So on the rear cluster, you've got eight screws, but only the outer four are actually required to be released to get the plastic lens off. The others are in case you want to take the whole cluster out. So if you're just changing a bulb, it's just the rear lens that you need to take out. confusing because there are holes there so that you can get to those screws but Land Rover they're only there because Land Rover obviously thought there might be a circumstance in which you want to take the cluster out without taking the lens off. Anyway, there we go. So the indicator is this one obviously and there's quite helpful uh, writing here I don't know if you can see that that says it's a 12 volt 21 watt bulb and then it's got like a three-way arrow here which is indicating that way up and down so all those three bulbs are the same so very simple just take it out twist it anti-clockwise slightly now it comes and then we take our new bulb put that back in just give it a test And then obviously to reassemble, just screw that back in. 